the Spice Girls belongs to the whole world and it's about sharing that joy and I always love it when I'm with them. So could a Spice Girl reunion tour actually happen? And is Ginger Spice telling fans what they really, really want? Yo, tell me what I want, what I really, really want. The last time we saw Jerry Hollowell Horner and the entire pop group together was the 2012 London Olympics. They did hit the road for their 2019 reunion tour, but without posh. Could we see a Spice Girls reunion? Well, I always get told off for saying anything Spice Girls, so I'm not saying anything. Is that Victoria she tells you off? No, she's actually on... See, now you're making me talk about it. She's on board. Okay, I'm going now. <laughs> she's on board. This is promising. And if it happens, Ginger Spice told me she'll be ready to shake it to the right one more time. If and when that happens, do you know what I mean? That would be a joyful moment. So we recently talked to Mel B. Okay, lovely. And she has a message for you. Okay, Jerry, you're on my turf now. Be a good girl. <laughs> and stop wearing white. We love her. She's amazing. <laughs> She's absolutely amazing and inspirational. While we wait for that spicy encore, Jerry continues to radiate girl power as a writer, too. The best selling author's ninth book, the first in Jerry's new fantasy adventure series, is out now. Congratulations on the new book, Rosie Frost and the Falcon Queen. Tell me about it. I felt like the world needs a new hero, someone ordinary. It's about finding the courage you never knew you had. I feel like when you were in the Spice Girls, that was the message that you guys were spreading, girl power and, yeah. and empowering young girls and women. It's almost like a full circle moment to then be able to continue spreading that message. Yeah, I think it's, it's an evolution. Yeah. The language continues, but it evolves. And the mother of two continues to evolve as well. She just turned 50 and encourages women everywhere to just embrace it. If I'm honest, of course, when I look in the mirror, I, you know, I'm vain. Mm -hmm. you know I mean, I think, oh, I want to look my best. But I also look to other women, say, how do you age with celebrating who you are, not trying to be younger, like Meryl Streep, Oprah, Judi Dench. If I can have the confidence, be myself. That's quite liberating, isn't it? It is, and it's words to live by. Yeah.